This video will show you how to make an invoice in Google Docs, like this one here, with the header and the line items. If you don't wish to create it yourself, I will put a link in the description to this version and you can make a copy of it. So let's make the invoice. I have a blank Google Doc page here. And the first thing you do is you insert the table to hold the header information. So insert table with four cells. Top left, put company logo. Invoice and date information in the top right. From information in the third cell. To information in the fourth cell. We'll reduce the size of this. To 10. And we'll change the background color to a light gray and we'll remove the line formatting on the table go to table properties and turn the table board to zero and we'll right justify that oops and this So that's the header of your invoice with the relevant information. Next we'll insert the table to hold the line items. So we go insert another table, this time four cells wide, down as many as you like. You can always insert row below for another line item. And then we put in our description rate hours and amount. Description put in a sample amount and we will right justify this column and we'll put in a header color for the header of the description. Next we'll add the total table. So insert a new table, this time with two cells and we'll say four rows and we'll drag it over to match the line items. In subtotal, maybe a discount, tax, and a total. We make this bigger, the total bigger, we'll bold it and make it bigger. And then underneath that, we'll put in insert a line break and then put in our payment terms and details. Maybe make them italic. So that's the basics of the invoice. And then we'll go along here on these two tables and we will just change the outline to make it a little bit lighter. So that gives a softer look to the invoice. To sharpen it up, you can make the line items headings bold. And then we'll just bring that table side into match the above. And that gives it a bit of a sharper look. And resize the columns, giving more space to the description as that's where most of the data will go. Right, bring the amount over, bring the hours over, that's a thin column. 
rate as a thin column and then we'll just bring this over to match and that's how you can create an invoice in google docs if you found this video helpful please subscribe to support the channel thank you